Welcome to my channel and today we are showing you how to stickify your digital art. Remember to press like on this video and subscribe to my channel. So let's get into this uh, creating stickers. Now what you can use stickers for is a whole lot of different things. If you want to use stickers because you just want to sell stickers, you can do that. You can print this out on sticker paper and um, cut them out and you can make stickers uh, or you can just use this as a project to further just enhance your AI art. So the first thing you're going to do to stickify your AI art, that's what I'm going to call it, stickify your AI art. You can go ahead and create a design. Now, it doesn't matter what size you you do, you know, if you doesn't, it doesn't really matter. Okay. Um, so I'm just going to pick the flyer portrait size eight and a half by 11. And if you want to do a lot of stickers and you can put them all on one, you know, on one thing here on one board, I'll call it and, or one design. And so then, so I've got my, my board here and I am going to go to my photos. So I've got all my photos, my uploads, sorry, got all my uploads of things I've created. So now let's say that I want to do this Saturday one. Okay. And this background is white. Let me go ahead and change it to black so you can see the difference there. So it looked white before, right? But now you can see the black around there. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to edit photo and you do need to have the pro version of Canva in order to do this. So I am going to go to background remover and I am going to simply click on background remover and boom, this is why it's great to put you know it on the black paper or something dark because you can see all of where it is gone. Now let's say that it didn't get rid of everything or if there was something else I wanted to get rid of, then I can go ahead and click the edit photo again. I can click background remover and then I can use my uh, mouse, I'm on my computer, and I can use my mouse and I can get rid of some more things. So I don't want to do that, but well, let's say, uh, let's see here, because that bun was kind of not working. So then I can erase that. I can change my brush size so that I can erase a little bit, be, you know, a little bit more defined. I'm not too good at this part with this mouse I have here. Uh, so anyway, so that's how you do that there. That's how you do that there. And uh, yep, so now we've got the design here. And now the next thing you'll do is go to edit photo once again. And then you're going to go here to shadows, go to shadows, go to shadows. And then you want to select outline, select outline. Now, you don't see an outline, although I selected outline, you don't see it there. You don't see it there because it's in black. And I'm going to hit the color wheel and I'm going to change it to white. All right, I changed the color to white. And now you can see that there is an outline. Now I can use the size and I can make the outline thicker or I can make it thinner, okay? So this is how I can use this to just enhance things, make it look a little different. So I kind of like this sticker size right here. And then boom, you've got your stickers. You've stickified your AI design, okay? Stickify your AI design. Let's choose another design so you can just kind of see how that works. So here's another one. What am I going to do again? And go to edit photo, remove the background. Okay. And then I'm going to go to AI photo or go to edit photo again. And I'm going to go to shadows, outline, change the color. Look, look how easy this is. Change the color and then change the thickness or leave it the way that it is. And that's how I can create my outline. I also want to show you another tool to stickify your AI projects. And uh, let's go ahead and get, grab another design. Let's grab this one. Okay. And for this one, I'm going to go to edit photo and I'm going to do magic grab. So when I do magic grab, it's going to grab the element, which is her, out of the design. 
And then I'm going to delete this background because I don't need it. And boom, I've done essentially the same thing. Now I'm going to go to edit photo, shadows, what outline, change it to white. Just want to show you how easy this is. And then boom, I am done with my stickers. And I can do this for each one of these since I have all of the days of the week, as you can see, and I can stickify my AI designs, put these on notebooks. I can print them out. I can put them on notebooks. I can put them on products, uh, mugs, um, blankets, whatever, whatever it is that you want to do. I can just use them in social media posts. So if you're looking for content and things, you can use these on social media posts. I do have these. Go to creativeurbanwoman.com, creativeurbanwoman.com, and you'll see this design there. So you're able to purchase this. And I believe there's the prompt. Let and we've got a sale going on this month because it's my birthday. It's my birthday month. My birthday's on April 20th. I'm, yes, I'm going to be 55. And so you're getting 55% off the entire store. Let's go ahead and join this party here. Is it my Etsy shop or you can join the party here? Either way, the party's going down um, and you'll be able to purchase this design. So let me know what questions you have and we'll see you next time. Until we meet again, be blessed. Be fruitful and multiply.